What's good, YouTube? Happy Pokemon 92 here, back again once again. Today, people, today we are back for another episode of our Pokemon Y Let's Play. And in the previous episode, you guys, we went ahead and picked up our third gym badge and finally experienced Mega Evolution in all of its glory. Anyways, before we get started in today's episode, I want to go and get ahead of God. I can't talk. I feel like I started every episode off like this. I want to go ahead and give you guys a quick update on the Catch 'em All run that we're doing. Um, it's got nothing to do with the actual Let's Play itself. It's just, uh, for those of you guys that are interested in it, that want to care about the update and progress and shit, I'll show you guys. Um, but, uh, we have officially, officially completed the Central Kalos Pokedex. I say we because through Twitter, a lot of you guys, and when I say a lot, I mean a shit ton of you guys have stepped forward and helped out by donating a lot of different Pokemon. And, uh, as you guys can see on the screen right now, um, I'm just gonna quickly go through it. Of course, the spots that are missing, like Greninja, is obviously in our party. Same with uh, Diggersby and Vivalon. But as you can see, uh, and Pyroar. <laughs> but as you can see, we have officially completed the Pokédex for the Central Kalos Pokédex. That was awkward. <laughs> but um, we have actually caught them all. Literally, we have caught them all. Not only have we completed the Pokédex, but we have caught them all. We have every form of every Pokémon for the Central Kalos Pokédex, all the way up to number 150 being Haxorus. Now, um, the one thing that I would suggest, because a lot of you guys have, um, donated, uh, Pokemon, and it's, like, I kind of want to, like, give you guys credit, because you, like, helped out. Like, I don't want to say that I did this, because I am not the only one that helped. You know, a lot of you guys helped. So, let me find a good example. I can't remember which one she sent. Oh, uh, which ones did she send? Which ones did she send? Oh, oh, I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. HJ Comet is a perfect example. She uh, helped out and sent me this masquerade, and she named it after herself. So if you guys want to help out and fill the Pokedex, help me fill the Pokedex, name whatever Pokemon you guys send me after yourself so that I know where it came from. Like, I guess I could check the original trainer and shit like that, but still, like, I feel like it means more. Does that, does that make sense? Am I going too much, too far here? I don't know, but either way, this is a good example of what I like you guys to do if you end up helping me out. Um, of course, all this is done through Twitter. I see people all the time leave their friends code in the comment section below and it's like, bro, it's not like really convenient to get back to you and shit. <laughs> Twitter is instant. So uh, hit me up on Twitter if you're interested in helping out. Of course, since we've completed the Central Kalos Pokedex, we're going to have to move on to the Coastal Kalos Pokedex, of course, um, and helping me get some of these evolutions and whatnot. I'm going to be putting in, putting in work uh, trying to get a couple of these guys evolved as well. Um, but besides that, uh, yeah, that's where we're at right now. we got to work on the Kalos Coastal Kalos Pokedex next, and then eventually, my box of Luchas. <laughs> eventually, uh, we will move on uh, to the mountain, which I don't know when the hell we're gonna get that, but we'll see. But either way, you guys, besides that, um, in the last episode as well, we had some sync issues with audio and uh, video and shit like that. If that ever happens, uh, just know that I'm sorry, I apologize. Um, that's one of the downsides to doing webcam, that's why a lot of people don't do webcam. Uh, on let's plays and shit because like what ends up happening is the the webcam ends up skipping frames like it's not my audio or anything like that it's just the webcam skips frames there's nothing I can do about it so I, I'll try my best to keep it lined up and in sync but there's only so much I can do sometimes but either way um off screen I went ahead and cleared out everything in a reflection cave and what is this route 11 because we're on route 12 now I did all that crap caught all them Pokemon and I accidentally started to go this way uh, before I realized that, hey, this is the next route, I should stop, and Serena Homegirl gave us HMO3, which is Surf, and I did go ahead and teach that to our Black Star, the Greninja, fuck it, might as well do a quick party update as well while we're here, Curly, our Diggersby is level 40, and people keep asking me to replace Curly and Cuddle, I'm not replacing them, <laughs> this is my first time playing through the game, I want to play with the Pokemon that I've been seeing so far, and that I enjoy, on uh, future LPs and, sh and shit like that, I might use uh, different Pokemon and whatnot, but I want to stick with the ones I got, yo. Let me play with my Pokemon, yo. Let me play with my Pokemon. We have Curly the Diggers beat level 40, Jupiter the Tyrantrum at level 40, and I did find out, you guys, Shiny Tyrantrum is blue. He is fucking blue. Are you kidding me? I want Shiny Tyrantrum so bad. Then we got Black Star, our Greninja at level 40 as well. Scar, our Pyroar, I almost called him Litleo at 43, and then Cuddle. The little rebel herself, didn't want to listen to us a couple episodes back, is level 45. She gains experience so quickly. Don't ask me why, she just does. Um, but it is what it is. I know that we're kind of, well, I don't want to say kind of, we are over leveled for this point in the game, but again, that just comes from capturing Pokemon and whatnot. But um, from here on out, I am going to um, end up 
swapping my party out for um other Pokemon while I'm capturing them and shit. Because that's the only reason they're over level. But anyways, that kind of Lapras. Well, this kind of Lapras won't save me from drowning. I feel bad though, because I can't afford to travel with another party. What? All right then, we just got a Lapras. <laughs> Damn. Um, no, no, no nickname for Lapras. So we just got a Lapras. Well, I guess that makes sense because they just give us Surf before we come here. Then we get a Lapras. So they're kind of trying to like get us to be like, hey, here's a Lapras. Use it. Use Surf. Just in case you never water type, I guess. But all right, we already taught Surf to our Greninja though, and Surf's battle animation is fucking tits. If you guys haven't seen it, my God, it's amazing. I'm going to try to avoid a couple of these trainers as well. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Hey, does this have an item in it? Oh, it's a rock smash. Okay. Awkward. Awkward. And what is this? What is this little summer haven we have here? Filled with Skittos. Skittos? What up, Nicky? I love Skittles so much, I feel like I've been hit with an attract move. Oh, thank you. She just gave us TM45 attract. In case you guys couldn't read. Another thing a lot of you guys have been asking me is to Oh you see Oh you see that spin Oh kill him Oh kill him You see that spin Do it again Do it again Ow <laughs> Anyways A lot of you guys have been asking me to use the Lucario that we got in the last episode until we get um whoever our sixth part sixth party member is gonna be No, I'm not gonna do that. I don't feel like fucking with a Pokemon that long just to swap them right back out, so it is what it is, niggas. It is what it is. Hey, can I ride you? I can ride go go. Stop moving, fat ass. You fat motherfucker. Come here. Oh, I'm on it. Oh, over the ledge. On a go go. On a go go. It's like, it's not a go go. It's a skiddo. It's a skiddo. Riding around on a motherfucker's skiddo. Mm, can you hear my chair? Uh, make a noise. Make a noise. Make a noise. Make it so much noise. Because that shit is loud. Ah, ah, up the thing. Can't go up the thing. Off the skittle. Alright, what's this item? It's a shiny stone. I actually needed a shiny stone. Because I couldn't um, evolve into... Uh, what is it? Floet into Florges. Um, Fly Baby's final Evo. And uh, Badoo or Roselia into Roserade. I think you need a shiny stone fat too. How the fuck do we get out of here? Oh damn. Oh damn, we just run around the whole route. Niggas can't fuck with us. Niggas can't fuck with us. Ah 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 got your skiddo. Got your skiddo. I saw an item back there. Of course, I'll come back through here and battle all these trainers and whatnot and look at the items and explore the Are you kidding me? Skiddo. Nigga, is this where we must part? Are we really gonna part ways right now? I hate to leave you on the side of the road like that, but deuces, nigga, I'm out. And we finally made it to Coramine City. I think that's what it was called. I don't remember. I didn't look at it. Hollow clip received. Who could it be? Oh, this bitch. Nappy, I challenge you to a battle in front of the gym. Prepare yourself. Okay. A uh, comment somebody made last time was, how come I don't do any French accents for any of the people since, like, the Kalos region is based off of France? I don't know. I've never really, like, tried a French accent before, but I feel like if I tried, it'd be terrible. A great Ampharos in Azure Bay. Where is Azure Bay? I'll have to check my handy-dandy nifty walkthrough guide here. Let's find out where Azure Bay is at. <laughs> Route 12. We just came through Route 12. Obtain Lapras. We just did that as well. Visit the Ba der Mer. Probably pronounced that wrong. Ranch and score a TM. We scored that TM all right. <laughs> what else do we have? Ride a Skittle and reach more treats. Oh, you best believer. Britches, we did that. Surf across Azure Bay. Hmm. Sadie's making noises while she's asleep. You guys hear that? You good? You wanna interrupt me again? Oh, I just woke her up. Okay, anyways. So yeah, Zur Bay. Uh, this large aquatic area is a favorite vacation spot for so many. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, 
But from what I can tell, it's completely optional. We don't need to go there. There is an Ampharo site in Azure Bay, so I'm sure I'll do um, a lot of this stuff off screen. Because looks like there's not a lot to do in Azure Bay, like that's relevant to the LP and whatnot. So I'll, I'll cover all that shit off screen. Just it's a bunch of just running around doing stupid shit. But didn't she just say? Did she just say she wanted to, uh, what you call it, battle us in front of the gym? Is that what she said? Got a silk scarf. I don't remember what the hollow hollow thing said. I don't even know if there's a gym in this city. Like I just wrote her off so quickly. I was like, I'm done with you, bitch. Out my face. What the hell is this nigga selling? Travel all around the world and collect all different types of incense. No, I'm good. I'm good. What the hell you want, nigga? A wild young trainer, are you? Let me guess, you wish to fish with all Pokemon in the water, right? I'm sure you do. Shall I lend you a ride? We got the good ride. So we got the good ride. So we got the good ride. So we got the good ride. I love that. I love that. That was that was one of the things that kept me from completing the Central Kalos Pokedex was because uh, I couldn't go back to like um, Sandaloon City and shit like that and catch Goldines and shit in the water because we, we just an O ride. All you get is fucking magic cops. But a lot of you guys did donate to help out for that, so I don't have to worry about it. What's going on with the Kalos Power Plant? I heard the electricity for Lumio City is getting lower than usual. Hmm. Interesting. So with that good rod, that'll help me complete a lot of the Coastal Pokedex as well. Watching me again, oh my god. Y'all niggas talk about a whole bunch of stupid shit, I ain't even gonna lie. Y'all niggas just stand outside just to talk. Talk, nigga, talk, nigga, talk, talk, talk. Ramos, your go-go? Hmm. Interesting. Not moving on. Hell, you got to say. Some gang of goons calling themselves Team Flair is out and about causing a bit of ruckus. No good could possibly come from associating with such a delinquents. Nigga, you using words that are way too big than what you need to be using. And how Diggersby is we with you? Yeah, nigga loves me. The bitch gave me a lucky egg. Thank you. As if getting experience in this game wasn't easy enough as it is. What's this? A Meryl? That's a Meryl. That's a Meryl. This is a hotel, so I wonder if Mr. Bunding is going to be in here. So, I'm nigga, the Kalos region of the line, so we should really check out my region. There's this facility that you wouldn't believe. Ah, oh, never mind, you'll see it in due time. What region is you from, nigga? You tell me. Is Mr. Bonding here? Is he here? This is not Mr. Bonding. Everything that I've ever known is upside down now. I mean, I understand he's been in Pokemon Centers a couple of times, but normally he, when he's there's a hotel in the city, he's in the hotel. You've caught every Pokemon in Central Kalos, and without any help. That's not true. <laughs> That's amazing. Here's an award. We hereby certify this trainer has achieved an admirable feat of solely capturing all Pokemon in the Central Kalos Pokedex. Wow, that's awesome! Thank you! I'll send this certificate to your house for you. Oh, so I guess if we go back to Manville Town, uh, we'll see it in the house somewhere and Mom will be all happy and proud of us. That's awesome! So we'll have to come back here and talk to the Mr. Junichi Masuda. That's who it is, the game director. I'm, I'm guessing that's who it is, right? Whenever we get the chance. Wait, we didn't, we didn't finish up here yet. What the hell is the name of this city? I don't know. Totally random TM quiz. If you give a correct answer, ooh, I'll give you a TM. Would you like to try the quiz? Sure, why not? Yeah, now here's a question. What's the move that I'm describing? It makes a target lose its ability to concentrate and lowers the target special attack stat. Uh. Okay, Trick Room. That's not it. Trick Room, I know what that does. Embargo keeps you from using items. Acrobatics. I've never heard of the move Confide. Never, ever, ever. I don't know what gen that's from. Because cause that's a mistake I've been making a lot lately that's saying, oh, this is a new 6th gen move, and everyone's like, no, Nappy, Camouflage is from whatever gen. Star Yu's had it forever. So I'm just going to go with Confide, because I've never heard of it. Correct, correct, correct! As promised, I'll also give you TM. I don't have to explain what kind of move this is, correct? TM100? Confide. Well, thank you. Alright, please come again tomorrow. Give me correct. Okay, so I guess that's the TM quiz lady. She gives you a new TM every single time. Ah, how fancy of her. Okay, so is that all that's here? What is this train? I'm so happy to be able to ride the monorail every time I go to the Pokemon Center. What? Seaside Station. Take the monorail here to go to the Pokemon Center and the Pokemon Gym. You ain't got to say no more, nigga. I'm ready to go. I don't want 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 to go. Why, hello, Nappy. Oh, my God. Yes, congratulations, I see you've finally obtained everything you need for Mega Evolution. A Mega Stone for the Pokemon, a Mega Ring for the Trainer, and a strong bond between you with your, your Pokemon. A strong bond? 
It's only a hypothesis, but I think the bond between Pokemon and Shriner is the key to this new evolution. But what is this bond exactly? And why are there examples of Mega Evolution only in the Kalos region? There's still so much we don't know. Because them niggas was older than what Mega Evolution is. Y'all niggas made it in 6th gen, not 5th, 4th, 3rd, or 2nd, or 1st. Okay, niggas. Does this make you think of something like Kalos' legendary Pokemon? Found only here in the Kalos region, right? Nowhere else. Maybe it's not a coincidence. I feel like that's not her original voice. I feel like these two, like, that's, that's Sycamore's voice with his nuts and a vice or some shit. Oh, what an excellent point indeed. The more you know, the more there is to research. The excitement never ends, does it? Hey, are we done here? Oh, that's right. I came here to give you this. What you got for me, nigga? HMO2 Fly. A lot of you guys were saying that I should dump Cuddle. Not only did you say we should dump Diggersby, but, or, or Curly, we should dump and cuddle our Vivalon because she can't earn fly. So the fuck what? We'll just get a fly slave out of the box and just fly where the fuck we need to go. Okay? Woosa. I ain't giving that fucking Vivalon out. That motherfucker is a beast. Use the HM fly to pop right over the Pokemon centers of places you've already visited. Well then, Nappy. Diantha, I hope to see you both again soon. Who is this bitch, Diantha? Bonds. They really are important to us, aren't they all? When I'm acting, I always uh, think I'm always trying to forge a bond between myself and the character I'm playing. If all I think about is how I'm nothing like a character, then I'll just hate playing it. But what I focus on is what I have in common with the character and put myself in her shoes. I might be able to understand her. It's the same for people or Pokemon. Oh, never mind me. I'm just babbling about my own things. Let's have a battle the next week. The next we meet, shall we? I'm still looking forward to it. Mmm. Mmm. If you guys have suggestions for a voice for Diantha, then let me know. Because, I don't know, some, I feel like Kalos just has so many voices. Will you be the monitor? Yes, I will. Out of the way, nigga. Excuse me. Excuse me. I need to get on in this motherfucking monorail. Chugga chugga, Thomas, take me where I want to go. To the other train station, which is God knows where. <laughs> See the monorail go back and forth does remind me a bit of a metronome. Obtained a metronome. Okay. If a Pokemon holding a metronome uses one move over and over again, the powers, the moves power will go up. What? That's amazing. Pokemon or monorails? Well, if you don't give me a chance to answer, bitch, I'm just not gonna answer you. Come to my house for Halloween and see if I don't fucking Sparta kick you off my fucking front porch, bitch. All right. So where do we end up? There's a Pokemon Center, so pff, might as well heal over here. Matt is well here. Why well here? So apparently there's a Pokemon gym somewhere around here. I would not mind checking that out because uh, I like to wreck house somewhere. And you know, do what I do. Oh, and look who it is! Isn't it how creepy he's standing in the fucking corner? No wonder why he wasn't in the fucking hotel. Corners are just so amazing. Try out the hey. How's it going there, friend? I'm Mr. Bonding, the expert on O-Powers. Let me ask you just in case. Do you need to hear an explanation about O-Powers? Bitch, you ask me this every single time I see you and I tell you no. Hey, that's my friend. Let's get started, shall we? It's the Bonding time. Too freaky. Too freaky. Befriending power. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Befriending power makes Pokemon grow freely more easily. You can use the O powers from the PSS, and the more you use them, the higher they level up. So use them as often as possible. Well, then, I do believe I should take my leave right about now. Hope to see you around. Toodles. Toodles. Alright, so that was Mr. Bunding. I wonder why he wasn't in the hotel. Since there's a hotel in that town. So, are we in... What fucking city are we in? I don't even know. Oh, Comarine City, the city where Bay and Butt are bound. I feel like that's one of those words that I feel like I should know how to pronounce, but I just don't. And that's the Pokemon Jam. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot all about her. I'm sorry, I'm late. Ugh. So could you show me Mega Evolution? Of course, whether you use Mega Evolution in battle or not, it's entirely up to you. But I'd like to know what Pokemon is what. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's do this shit, nigga. Ah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Serena, you don't want this bitch. You only got three Pokemon and one's me out. Let's whoop that me out. Sticks ass. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Diggsby, Curly. Diggsby, Curly. Fight. Ah, ah, fight. Ah, ah. Return. Smack that bitch. Return. Really? Fake out? Really? Really? Serena, this is why you aren't worthy for Mega Evolution right here. Because you use bitch-ass moves like Fake Out. 
And just to say it again, I know I said this last episode, but I do understand, I am aware that we are overleveled. Uh, that's not by intention. I just end up happening to be that way as I was collecting Pokemon and shit, so, yeah. Alright, what other hell else you got? Quilladin? 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 Let's wreck cows, nigga. Wow! Woo! He took that like a champ. He is a defense monster, though, so. But that bite ain't gonna do nothing to me, nigga. That bite ain't gonna do nothing to me. How much do you love me, Curly? Wham! How much do you love me? Yeah! A lot of people are saying they don't like Diggersby because of his design. They're like, they could they could have done better with him. I'm like, that's fucking ingenious. He's a rabbit, and they made him a part ground type, and they gave him fucking arms for ears. How is that not fucking sick? I love that. She's got an Absol. But she doesn't have a Mega Ring, so fuck your Absol, Knuckle. How about you hold this double kick? Ha! Ooh, ooh, ah! Ooh, ooh, ooh! He held it pretty well, actually. Never mind. Whoop! Nigga, you ain't gonna do nothing to my motherfucking Curly, nigga. You ain't doing nothing. Hit him with that strength, nigga. Hit him with that flex. Hit him with that flex. Next! Next, next, please. Curly just shits all over your entire team. Jupiter, my nigga, Jupiter's a 40 wood. Ooh, yeah, go cry somewhere else, bitch. I don't care. As a Pokemon trainer, I find you really interesting. Look, please. Even though we settled from Vanderbilt Town at the same time, you somehow became stronger than I am. <laughs> what could be so different about us? Bitch, I'm better than you. Well, good luck with your gym battle. Do your best, okay? All right, to the gym we go. Co Marine City Gym. Co Marine. So are we? Uh, it's not a water type gym. I was gonna say are we gonna have a water type gym, but apparently not. This is the big ass treehouse that was from the trailer that everyone was speculating about. Yo, nigga, how's the bout, little spout? This is the Hitmonchan. What's the plan, Hitmonchan? You gotta figure it out yet, champ. Yup, old man, Ramos' gym is all about grass. It's simple, right? You see a vine hanging in front of you, you just grab that bitch right on. And hang on for dear life. That's maybe the most important part of it all, right, nigga? Alright, so if this is a grass type gym, I got just a nigga for you. We got our buddy Scar here. And we are actually going to move the amulet coin to Scar because we always oh, still got that Lapras in our party. Lapras is not officially part of our party, but. Alright, so let's check this shit out. Oh, we climbing, nigga. We climbing. So, normally what I like to do in gyms is I like to fight all the trainers. Oh, that's a dead end. So, I think what I'm going to try. Can we go? So what I think I'm gonna try to do is still do that. How do I do? I have to press A. Like I have to press A to do that. Fine. I like to fight all the trainers because it's like free experience, just chilling right there. So I think I'm gonna continue to try and do that and work our way to the top of the tower. And wouldn't this be nice? We got a gym badge last time. We're about to get another one right now. Back to back. That's a nice change of pace from the get a gym badge and nine episodes later get another gym badge style that we've been doing so far. This nigga right here, yeah, wreck house, motherfucker. I'm, I'm tr I want to try to do all the flamethrowers. Damn, 2K in experience. Oh my god, they just make it so easy. Do I have an O power on? Did somebody give me an O power or some shit? That's a ridiculous amount of experience. Holy shit. Whatever. Whatever. Whatever, nigga. Whatever. I ain't mad about it. That's crazy experience, but I ain't mad about it. I'll tell you that much right now. I ain't mad about it. So, I, I guess we cleared the first floor? No, that was the second floor. Well, unless it's like one of those fancy buildings that has a ground floor, then a first floor. Whoop! Alright, so that's it for that one. So, okay, no trainers on that one. Unless they got. Is there. Oh, it's a big fucking cylinder. Is there like a backside to it? Shoddy, show me your backside! Whoop! And that's a dead end, but it's a trainer, so fuck it. I want to try and save the PP for my flamethrower, though. <laughs> Said PP. I want to try and save the PP for my flamethrower, though, so I'm going to see. Of course, you have the one Pokemon that's only fucking. Only way to wreck it with fire moves. So stupid. So stupid, nigga. So stupid. But let's see what we can do here with an echoed voice. It sucks, because Pyroar is a special attacker, but we have Crunch and. Headbutt on him at the same time. So, yeah. Mm. 
Uh, let's see, can I crush you or just... To, oh, no, no. Oh, wait, Steel lost its immunity. Or immunity resistance to dark types or whatever. Get... Oh, wow. Lucky bitch. I don't give a fuck about no iron barbs. Lucky bitch. How do you hang on like that? That's alright, though. That's alright, though. Hold this echo voice. Roar at him. Arr! Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Like I get wrecked. You wanna know what funny thing about Pyroar? And I tweeted this out, and apparently like, some other people were saying like, like Charmander and I don't know who else, but Charmander was a good example of, it's of uh, Pokemon that's like this. But if you take Pyroar into oh Litleo, of course as well. Um, if you take Pyroar into Pokemon of Me and try to pet his mane, you'll burn your hand, and you can't pet him. It's fucking hilarious, cause I'm like, oh, it's ah! yeah, just like that. The game screams at you and everything. It sounds like Charmander from Pokemon Origins. Ah, when Squirtle bit him on the neck, that was the funniest shit in the world. Ah, ah. I mean, in tears. This trainer is a breeder. That's why they have so many Pokemon. I was gonna say, why does this trainer have so many fucking Pokemon? You're not even a gym leader, my dude. What the fuck? Waste my precious time like this, Knuckle. What is this? Planted your roots? Bitch. 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 Uh uh. Bitch. Not again. Oh, nom, 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 Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, motherfucker. Get up, 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 wrecked. Level 45. We are so overleveled. Oh my god. <laughs> I hope the game catches up to me. Because <laughs> we are so ridiculously terribly overleveled. My god. Okay, so that's a dead end. So let's uh head back. We came up the rope, so we can only go up that way. And I guess we can go down here? What's down here? Hmm. There's another rope to go up. You like how I, how I talk about how ridiculously overloaded we are, but at the same time it's like, I don't want to lose any available experience that I could get? Yeah. Double-edged sword. Double-edged sword, class side. But you know what, just to get these battles to go faster, Fuck the PP, nigga. Fuck the PP. Flamethrower in this motherfucker. Wah! Fuck the bitch up. Fuck the bitch up. Literally, it was a female Rosalia. Fuck that bitch up. All right, what else? With Lapras is getting levels. Lapras is getting levels. You about to get boxed? What you about to get? <laughs> God damn. Remind him. Shuddered. How about you hold this flamethrower? Sound like a good plan to me. If I ever heard one, shot. Shot, like a shot. Black Star is 41, okay. We are so over level. So over I hope, like I, like I said a couple minutes ago, I hope that the game catches up and that we don't say this over level throughout the entire thing. That would really kind of put a damper on things for the game. I mean, I know a lot of people are saying that 6th gen is the easiest gen yet. Um, but that would really fucking suck. And why are we going up more high, higher and higher, higher? Uh, okay, fuck it. Let's just get to the top. Fuck the trainers, nigga. Fuck the trainers. And there's a trainer. Damn! Ah, jet! I don't know. I, I lost track of how many floors we've gone up. I honestly, I couldn't even try. I couldn't even try to remember right now. You have a gloom. Look at this pot smoking motherfucker right here. That's okay though. That's okay though, nigga. That's okay. You can have this flamethrower gloom. I'll put you at your misery. You look like you don't even want to be here right now. It look like you just want to go lay down and go to sleep. Some nigga woke you up at your Pokeball. <laughs> God damn. All right. Who else? Executor. Oh, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt to kill Executor. I love Executor. Execute is one of the worst Pokemon ever. Period. Hands down. Terrible Pokemon, but Executor is absolutely worth going through all the pain and trouble and hassle to get. It's like it's like a grass version of Magikarp to Gyarados, uh, except Executor's second typing is actually worth it. <laughs> it's actually worth having, as opposed to Gyarados, who's flying is not worth it. But yeah, god damn. Alright, so can we get to the gym leader? Can we get to Ramos? Is there a possibility? Are we up here to Ramos shit? Damn! I feel like I'm playing Legend of Zelda or some shit. Going through all these fucking trees. 
And when I say that, like, I'm referencing Wind Waker, I don't, I, I don't want to, like, reference something and incorrectly quote it, but, like, you guys remember the, like, I remember it was, like, early on in Wind Waker, there's, like, a grass or tea tree or leaf temple or some shit, I haven't played that game in years, but, as you just saw, I'll do it again, just to make sure you guys have missed it. Only you can prevent loss, save data, so make sure you say that game whenever you get the chance, before any important shit goes down, so let's go ahead in here and whip his ass, because we're over levels, fuck. <laughs> Whoa, don't play with scissors, bitch! Huh! So you've made it up here! Oh! So you've made it clear up here! I'm the gym leader! Ramos is the name! So what do you think, old oh, Pastapper? Did you enjoy the garden's playground I made with all these sturdy plants of mine? The strength is a son of my strength as a gym leader, as a gardener and a gym leader! You're sure for facing that! Is this a beard that you have, or is this like a part of your skin? I'm gonna guess it's a beard because it's lighter, but that you need to get that checked out, bruh. So he's gonna leave with a jump pluff. Eh? Jump pluff. Yeah, I like how Wow, I like how the arena is exactly where we're at. Like they could have made it so that like one side was like the entire thing was like bookshelves, but the one side is actually like the, the door that we were facing. This is amazing. I love this game so much. But we're gonna wreck house right now. I'm sorry. Like I said, we're overleveled as fuck. I understand that. We're fifteen levels above. My god. Oh my god, it's so over-leveled. <sighs> 16 levels above, shit. That is ridiculous. Jupiter wants to learn Thrash. Please do, what should we get rid of for Thrash? I'm gonna get rid of Dragon Tail. Because we already have Dragon Claw. I don't wanna get rid of Crunch and Rock Tomb with Stab as well. So let's go ahead and get rid of... Did they lower the power of Thrash? I thought Thrash was like 120 or some shit. Oh no no no, I was looking at I was looking at Dragon Tail's power. Never mind. Never mind. Go go. So is this your ace nigga? Go go. Yeah, I see all the sparky shit. And plus it's a six gen. Go ahead, hold this for me. Ah! Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. None of these niggas can take a flamethrower from the mighty pyro. None of them can. None of them can. And of course, they've changed the game up now, so none of the gym leaders or only wants to learn bounce. The fuck, nigga, why are you trying to learn bounce? Nah, I'm good. I'm good. We already have one two-turn move with dig. I'm good. We don't need it. No, keep all moves. Give up? Yes, give up. White flag, nigga. White flag. Weeping bell. Oh, why can't they at least give him a victory bell? I was gonna say, like, a common trend I've seen so far, and this is going. This is last Pokemon 2, it goes right along with this. They've totally, like, just nerfed all the gym leaders, the Elite Four, everybody. Black 2, White 2, the Elite Four had four Pokemon each. Like, I get it, the Elite Four, you have four Pokemon each, but that just, that takes away any intimidation factor, that takes away any sort of challenge to it, because when it comes to Elite Four and those raised levels like that, there's a big difference between four Pokemon and a full team of six. And this bullshit, gym leaders having three Pokemon? Come on, dude. Why are you a gym leader? The Kalos region? Well, I guess it's French. And the French were never in a war, and they were always easy to beat, so... <laughs> oh. Well, French were never in a war. You get what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? I know they were involved in uh, world wars and shit, but... Anyways. You believe in your Pokemon, and they believe in you too. And they believe in you... Oh. Mighty Oaks from Acorns Grow. Go on then, you've earned it. Here's your own plant badge, bro. Plant badge. Nigga, they had Rumble badge last time, and now it's just called Plant Badge. <sighs> if you got yourself a Plant Badge, then you can use the HM Fly even when not battling. It's a real boon. Pokemon up to level 60 will listen to you too. Easy as wonderful log. Even if you got them from a train. Here, have this too. Might as well make hay while the sun shines, I reckon. Grass not. Yay. Thank you for the useless move half the time. <laughs> that team there is for grass not. You can use it to trip up your opponent in the grass. The heavier the opponent, the harder it falls and the more to hurt. It is a marvel. Three little blades of grass can even break through concrete. And I can't help admire that strength. Nigga, your gym was easy peasy lemon squeezy. E easily the easiest one yet. Karina, I think, gave us the, the most challenge out of all the gym leaders that we had to face. Whee! I had to. Get mad. I had to. So, we got our fourth gym badge. 
which is nice. It's awesome. It's titties. And I think that I'm going to explore Comarine City a bit more and uh, work on chipping away at that coastal Pokedex a little bit more before we move on any further. Um, I'm sure we won't finish it in between now and the next episode, but I want to chip away at it a little bit more. But with that being said, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and deposit this Lapras in the PC. Saving my game first, of course, because we just had some important shit go down. But hey, we're about halfway through the game, I'd say, just based off of badges. Um, but besides that, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this episode up here. I hope that you all have been enjoying the series thus far. If you have and you enjoyed today's episode as well, make sure you smash that like button for me. And of course, thank you. For all your support and thank you for checking out the video. You know me, YouTube, Nap182. I'm out.